Alright guys, we're back with another NHL offseason talk, and this is going to be number three. And, yeah. Early on today, we just, we just did the Toronto Maple Leafs, and now we're going to be doing the Ottawa, Ottawa Senators. Alright, so let's get started. So they have uh, only six draft picks. They have one, two, three, four, five, six. That's all they have. And they're picking, they got uh, the 12th overall pick in the upcoming draft. So, yeah. Yeah, their new GM says there's like a lot of, um, what do you say? He says he likes um, the beat. They not twelve pick. He likes the twelve pick, and he says um, there's there's some uh, players that he wants to draft. And yep, good players he wants to draft the twelve pick. So yeah, all right. Now let's get to the roster. All right, let's look at the Ottawa Senators. Ottawa Senators uh, roster. So they have um, Bobby Ryan. Mike Hoffman. Mike Hoffman is a restricted free agent and obviously Ottawa Senators is going to re-sign him. Um, they have Clark MacArthur, Mark Stone, Kyle Turs, Mikhail Zibanejad, Zach Smith, Chris Neal, Pajot, Curtis Lazar, Piempel, restricted free agent, Alex Chieson, restricted free agent, Piempel, he'll be uh, re-signed, Chieson. I have no idea if he's going to be resigned. And the goaltenders they have is the Hamburglar, which is Andrew Hammond, and they also have Craig Anderson. And yeah. Their defense they have Eric Carlson, their captain. Dion Vanuff. Chris Wyman, Mark Meathot. Patrick Rearcoch, restricted free agent. And they're, they're letting him go. I believe they say they're going to let Patrick Rearcoch go. Uh, Mark Borowiecki, Cody Cece, restricted free agent. So that is their roster, so, yeah. So this offseason, they have to worry about resigning Mike Hoffman, Pion Ball, and then I think they're letting go of Rikosh. I think that's what the GM said. I'm, you know, I'm not, I'm not sure. I think that's what the GM said. Playoffs. Do I think the Ottawa Senators are going to make the playoffs? Um, you know, there's a chance they can. Because, like, the Eastern Conference is, like, is the weakest, con weakest conference. So they could make the playoffs. If I say they will make the playoffs, they probably won't make the playoffs. If I say they won't make the playoffs, then they will make the playoffs. Because two season two years ago that they won, they won, they made the playoffs, and play against the Montreal Canadiens, and lost in six games. And next, and then the year just the season just passed. They didn't make the playoffs, and they got the twelfth overall pick. Um, let's see. It doesn't got enough for like full season. Um, crap. Are they gonna make playoffs? You know, I think. I don't think they're gonna make playoffs. I don't think they are. But like I said, they could. But I don't think they are. When I look at this defensive core, I think it looks. Pretty good. Other than one two guy. Vanuff and Carlson. They also have Chris Weidman. Oh, weird. I think they'll go after a defenseman in the free agency. And forwards. I think they'll go after some forwards as well and defensemen. I think they're good on goaltenders. Andrew Hammond, he played outstanding first year. He only, he, he got twenty wins. One regulation loss, and I believe two overtime losses. I'm like, wow, Andrew Hammond. And then the year just passed, and 
and then you make playoffs. So yeah, pretty interesting. Yeah, they they'll go after a defenseman. Maybe they'll go after Brian Campbell. I don't know. Jason Demers. I don't know. <sighs> All right. Um, there you guys have it. That is my. That is the auto. I did my Ottawa Senators. And then tomorrow, for number four and five, okay, four, we're going to talk about the Calgary Flame. We're going to talk about um, Alberta teams tomorrow, which is Calgary and Edmonton. So that's coming up tomorrow. So, yeah, um, I'll see you guys tomorrow for that video. And, yep, I'll see you guys later. Bye.